Hi everyone, this is Isaac from Compositional IT. We're going to see today how to deploy web applications written on ASP.NET in F Sharp into Azure in less than five minutes. I've created an F Sharp web application in Saturn and set it to always return the text hello from F Sharp. The first thing to do is ensure that the SDK is set correctly. That's microsoft.net.sdk.web. Next, publish the application using the release configuration to a folder, which in this case I've called publish. This will contain all of the required files for your application, as well as a web config file, which is required for IIS and ultimately Azure to run your application easily. Next, I'm going to create another console application in F Sharp, which we're going to use to deploy our resources into Azure. The next thing to do is to add the farmer package to this console application. Now we need to open the farmer and the farmer.resources namespaces in order to access some of the components in farmer that we'll need. I'm now going to create some infrastructure for my web application. So I'm going to create a web app and the name of it will be farmer video. Next, I'm going to tell farmer that after creating the web application infrastructure, I'd like to also copy up the outputs from my application, which is in the publish folder. Next, I'm going to create an ARM template in Farmer, which has a location of North Europe. And I'm going to add the My First App resource to that ARM template. Lastly, my program is actually going to execute this deployment using the Azure CLI as a quick way to do it. And I'm going to specify the resource group name as Pharma Video RG. Now I'm going to run this application. The first thing I'll be asked to do is to sign in to Azure to give Pharma permissions to deploy these resources on my behalf. Now all I need to do is go into the portal and find my resource group. And I can see now in the deployment section that a deployment has indeed succeeded. I can also look at the actual ARM template that was generated by Pharma and see that three resources were created. I'm now going to navigate to the web app resource that we created and then browse to the URL that Azure has allocated it. As you can see, our application is now running. Pharma by default will also automatically create an application insights instance and link it to your web app. For example, the live metric stream that comes with Application Insights will automatically show any requests coming through, as well as failures, on the website. I hope you found that useful. You can find out more about Pharma in the links below this video. I also want to point out that Pharma can be used to deploy any web applications. It's not coupled directly to F Sharp specific deployments in any way. Make sure you subscribe to our channel if you want to automatically get notified of new videos we're creating on technologies such as SafeStack and Pharma. Thanks for watching.